When scientists declare a species extinct, it feels final. A chapter closed forever. School books mark the date, museums collect the bones, and the world moves on. But sometimes, extinction is not the end. Against all odds, animals we believed gone forever have resurfaced, alive, surviving in secret places, waiting to be rediscovered. These moments aren't just scientific milestones, they're miracles that shake our faith in what we know about nature. From ancient fish thought lost for millions of years, to elusive birds rediscovered after a century, to mammals that came back from the dead. Today we'll uncover 10 extinct animals rediscovered in modern times. And as you'll see, extinction is not always forever. The first creature on our list is perhaps the most famous rediscovery of all, the coelacanth. For 65 million years, this fish existed only in fossils. Textbooks taught it vanished with the dinosaurs, an ancient experiment in evolution that never made it. Its strange lobe fins were believed to be the missing link between sea creatures and the first land dwellers. But in 1938, a South African fisherman pulled up something extraordinary, a massive, blue-scaled fish unlike anything seen before. Local museum curator Marjorie Courtney Latimer recognized it from drawing she had only seen in paleontology books. Scientists were stunned. Articles around the world called it the living fossil. Since then, divers and submersibles have filmed coelacanths drifting slowly in deep waters off South Africa, Madagascar, and Indonesia. Videos show them glowing blue in the darkness, their fins moving almost like arms. For millions of years, they hid in the deep, far beyond human reach. The coelacanth's rediscovery was like finding a dinosaur alive today, and it changed everything we thought we knew about extinction. Moving on, we come to one of the strangest survival stories, the Lord Howe Island Stick Insect. Nicknamed the Tree Lobster because of its size, this insect, as thick as a human finger and as long as your hand, once swarmed its island home. But when a supply ship wrecked in 1918, black rats invaded the island. Within a few years, the insects vanished. By the 1920s, they were officially declared extinct. For decades, all that remained were dried specimens in museums. But in 2001, rock climbers scaling Ball's Pyramid, a jagged volcanic spire rising 1,800 feet from the Pacific Ocean, made an astonishing discovery. Clinging to a single tea tree bush high on the cliffs was a tiny surviving colony of the stick insects. Articles described it as one of the greatest insect rediscoveries in history. Videos of the insects in captivity show them moving slowly, gripping with powerful claws. Today, conservationists breed them carefully in labs, hoping to reintroduce them to Lord Howe Island. From a single bush on a remote rock, a species brought back from the dead. The next rediscovery is haunting and beautiful, the New Guinea Singing Dog. Once common in the island's highlands, these wild canines were believed extinct in the wild for over 50 years, surviving only in zoos. Their eerie, melodic howls, rising and falling like a chorus of voices, earned them their name. But many stories from locals hinted they were still alive. Shepherds and hunters reported hearing strange calls echoing through the mountains. In 2016, researchers investigating those reports captured photographs of wild, dog-like animals. Genetic testing later confirmed what many suspected. These were indeed New Guinea singing dogs. Articles hailed it as a rediscovery that blended science and legend. Viral videos of their haunting howls shocked the world. They sound unlike wolves, unlike dogs, almost otherworldly. The singing dog proved that even in the modern world, wild voices can rise from silence. Next up is New Zealand's Takahe, a large flightless bird with deep blue plumage, a bright red beak, and powerful legs. By the late 1800s, hunting and introduced predators devastated the species. In 1898, the Takahe was declared extinct. For 50 years, it survived only in Maori stories. Legends whispered of hidden valleys where the birds still walked. Then, in 1948, a team of explorers searching Fiordland's Murchison Mountains stumbled upon something 
incredible. A small flock of living Takahe. Articles describe the moment as a miracle. Scientists rush to protect the survivors, fencing valleys and relocating populations. Today, thanks to conservation, there are over 500 Takahe alive. Videos show them grazing in alpine meadows, living proof that legends can carry truth. Once thought extinct, now a symbol of survival. Our next rediscovery comes from Spain's Canary Islands, the La Palma giant lizard. For centuries, people assumed it had gone extinct in the 1500s, wiped out by cats, hunting, and habitat destruction. Fossil bones were all that remained. But in 2007, locals on the island reported sightings of unusually large lizards basking on sunlit cliffs. Biologists investigated and, to their shock, found a small population of La Palma giant lizards still alive. Articles called it one of Europe's greatest rediscoveries. Conservationists now guard the species carefully, breeding them in captivity and restoring wild populations. Imagine believing a creature was gone for 500 years, only for it to crawl back into the light. Moving to Australia, we find one of the most mysterious rediscoveries, the night parrot. This small, green, nocturnal bird was considered extinct for over a century. Only a handful of specimens existed in museums collected in the 1800s. But in the outback, rumors persisted. Many stories from farmers spoke of strange whistles at night and blurry shadows darting between bushes. Bird watchers spent decades chasing the ghost. Then, in 2013, a naturalist captured the first confirmed photographs of a living night parrot. Articles called it the holy grail of birdwatching. In 2015, researchers recorded its call for the first time in modern history. A soft, haunting whistle in the desert night. Videos now show this shy bird alive, though still extremely rare. For a species lost for 100 years, the night parrot's rediscovery was nothing short of astonishing. The Galapagos Islands are famous for their giant tortoises, but one species, the Fernandina giant tortoise, was thought extinct for over 100 years. The harsh volcanic island it once inhabited seemed lifeless, and no tortoises were seen since the 1800s. But in 2019, researchers found something remarkable. A lone female tortoise walking across Fernandina Island. Articles worldwide celebrated the find, comparing it to discovering a ghost of Darwin's era alive today. Scientists now hope to find more individuals to start a breeding program. Videos of her slowly lumbering across black volcanic rock became a global sensation. A creature written off for a century had proven everyone wrong. Now we head to North America, where the black-footed ferret, one of the continent's rarest mammals, was declared extinct in 1979. But in 1981, a Wyoming ranch dog brought home a strange carcass. When scientists examined it, they realized with shock it was a black-footed ferret. Further searching revealed a hidden population of over 100 individuals. Articles described it as a conservation miracle. Breeding programs were launched, and today, hundreds of ferrets once again roam the prairies. Videos show them playfully bounding through the grasslands, little predators restored from the edge of oblivion, an animal once erased from existence brought back by chance. The next rediscovery shocked the scientific world, the Somali elephant shrew, or Sengi. This tiny creature, with its long trunk-like nose, hadn't been seen since the 1970s. For 50 years, it was presumed extinct. But in 2020, researchers setting camera traps in Djibouti got the surprise of their lives. The footage revealed Sengis darting across the desert floor, alive and well. Articles exploded with headlines, lost for half a century, found again. Locals had always told stories of strange little animals scurrying through the rocks, but science hadn't listened. The rediscovery proved once again that local knowledge can lead to miracles. 
And finally, the number one rediscovery, the Kashmir musk deer. Known for its saber-like fangs, this shy nocturnal deer vanished from scientific records in the 1940s. Its musk was so valuable it was hunted to the brink of extinction. But in 2009, researchers spotted a living musk deer in Afghanistan. More sightings came in 2011 and 2014, confirming its survival. Articles described it as a species reborn from legend. Locals had whispered for years about mysterious fang deer leaping across cliffs, but few believed them. Today, videos of the musk deer show its strange vampire-like appearance, reminding us that nature is often stranger than myth. These rediscoveries remind us of one powerful truth. Extinction is not always the end. From fish thought lost for 65 million years, to parrots vanishing for a century, to tiny mammals rediscovered after decades of silence, life finds a way. For every rediscovery, there may be countless more species waiting to surprise us, hidden in jungles, deserts, oceans, and mountains. Which of these comeback stories amazed you the most? Tell us in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe, because next time, we'll uncover even more creatures thought lost to time.